So summertime is a great time to slow down and lean into your children's interests. It's the time of year where we want to be outside and enjoy the weather, enjoy the season that we're in. So in this video, I'm going to share with you some fun summer homeschool activities that you can do with your kids. So let's get to it. Hey, it's Sue in here from the homeschool front and I'm just popping on real quick because I totally forgot that this is a collaboration with Alicia from DAC Family. It's a summer boredom buster playlist collaboration. So make sure you go check that out down below and I'll let the other me finish the video. <laughs> Start a garden with your kids. Teach your kids to cook. Break out those science experiments that you've been avoiding. You know which ones I'm talking about. Map out your neighborhood. Go on a scavenger hunt. And if you're looking for scavenger hunt ideas, I have a link down below with a, a little scavenger hunt PDF that you can download. Go check out your local library. They often have fun summer activities. Visit a local museum or gallery. Research your town and find some historical sites that you can visit. Take a mini road trip to a nearby town and go exploring there. Visit a local zoo or botanical garden. Go take a hike and go birding. Break out your camping gear. And if you can't score a campsite this summer, cause it's too late, cause you do have to reserve a bit in advance, then camp in your backyard. Or sometimes local parks have camping nights. Buy postcards on all of your adventures. And then send them to friends and family. And then of course, document everything you do, whether it's for your per own personal use, or maybe you want to share it with the, uh, the public, it's up to you. So as you can see, summertime is a great opportunity to spend time with your family outdoors. And I hope that you take into consideration some of these ideas and utilize them in your homeschool. And if you found value in this video, make sure you hit that like button. And if you haven't done so yet, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.